Hi, and welcome to Soul Power Snacks. For today's snack animal, you will need three mandarin oranges, one blueberry, one date, a couple leaves of spinach, and a couple chocolate chips. You can leave one of your oranges whole and pull the other pieces apart on the other two. Once you have your oranges peeled, set them aside and grab your dates. Now dates can be a little bit tricky to peel with your fingers. I cut mine. Please make sure you always ask an adult to help you if you ever have to do any kind of cutting. I'm gonna make this look like a tree because guess what? Sloths spend most of their lives in trees. Isn't that pretty incredible? Dates can be a little bit sticky, but that's what makes them so fun, if you ask me. You can always change up how you want your tree or your branches to look. And if yours doesn't look like mine, that's great. Make yours look however you want. Next comes the fun part. We get to make the body of our sloth. We're gonna take all of our orange chunks, dump them all out, whee! Let's get started. Guess what do you think this is gonna be? Did you guess the head of the sloth? You're right. I'm gonna set that right there next to the tree. Now, you might have some extra orange slices. That's okay. Feel free to nibble them up or layer them just as so. Make a nice thick sloth body. Then I'm gonna arrange my sloth's arms, reaching up for that date. Same thing with the legs, make them go reaching up. Your sloth might look different than my sloth, and that's okay too, because we're all different. Being different is pretty awesome. If you have extra oranges, like I said, layer them or nibble them up. It's totally your choice. You get to decide how you want to make your sloth look. I think I'll get rid of a couple extra pieces here. I'm even going to move some of my dates around. I've got some extra oranges here. I'll just put them back in my bowl as a nice little treat to have after I'm done. What do you think? How's your sloth looking? Do you like it? I bet it looks pretty great. Now I'm going to take out my spinach leaves and I'm going to use them as real leaves, real life looking leaves on the tree. If you don't have spinach, any kind of green would work. You could use broccoli, kale, whatever you have that you think will look awesome. Are you ready for the last step? You know what that is. We're going to use our blueberry, make a nose, and our two little chocolate chips. For our eyes, we have one eye here. Oops. Falling a little bit. And another eye here. And these are dark chocolate chips, which means they don't have any dairy in them. <gasps> Look at that! We have our sloth! Is your sloth cute too? My sloth is pretty cute. And I have all of this yummy goodness to eat. And all of these extra oranges to eat too. What do you think, Mr. Sloth? Do you think you look cool too? Yes, I do. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed making a sloth with us today. Remember, boys and girls, it's really important to eat healthy. Thanks for making a snack animal with us today. We loved using oranges, dates, spinach, and even a blueberry to make a nutritious, fun, and easy little snack. We hope you'll join us next time. Click the subscribe button, ring that bell, and follow us on Instagram for more snack animal creations. See you next time. Bye.